Happy Homebrew Wednesday, everybody, from the land of losers. That's right. Nine days we held the shield. It's gone. Anyhow, not talking about it. End of story. Enough. I'm Pilsner. Tasting pretty good. Um, it's made with a bloody expensive yeast, actually. Uh, American 2 yeast. 20 bucks a packet. So I tried to save it this week. Before I never, never crack it up. Let's have a little look at that footage. Me In trying case, to prove this is my yeast saving. So, this is my American American two, I think it's called yeast, and just added some water to it, some boiled cold water, and just going to let that to sort of settle out. Minutes and then they'll decant it into another sterilized jar. That's the plan. So it's been sitting for about 10 minutes, and can you see how it's sort of separated into two layers? So now pour that into the air. Nice. Yeah, so that's my sort of attempt at being frugal and um, it's in the fridge now. So we'll just see how that goes. Um, plan to use it down the track. Um, think of using it in um, Grant Baker's and uh, Amarillo. So I might split it half with that yeast. It's got quite a nice fruity ester about it, which is not good for my Pilsner, but anyhow, it's good, it tastes good beer. Um, and thinking putting yeah, so five yeast in the other half of it, so I'll split it and put two couple of different types of yeast in there and see how they go. So that's the plan, anyhow. Uh, what else is up? Hey, I promised you this last week. Capturing the Wookie. Who is the Wookie? Sounds random, eh? Um, that's Richard Emerson's nickname down here because he looks like Wookie out of Star Wars for you Star Wars anoraks out there. So part of our craft beer festival was to um, promotional stuff as we develop a little movie about our fantastic burgers that we'll be selling um, and our little Farrah plant that we've got at work and um, and how we might um, hook Richard Emerson into this so <laughs> uh, let's have a look at the video it's, it's quite a hard case I'll put the link down below if you want to share among mates or whatever um, but it does involve Richard Emerson gangsters and small cars <laughs> All right, let's have, have a bit of fun. This is my gift to you. Ladies and gentlemen, to those among you who are easily frightened, we suggest you turn away now. To those of you who think they can take it, we say, welcome to the madhouse.
so um, believe it or not, I actually did that on work time. <laughs> um, probably not going to get an Oscar for that one. But if you want to know what happened to the Wookiee, come see the Wookiee or come see us at the Craft Beer Festival here in Dunedin. Uh, yeah, we're looking forward to it. It's going to be good times. Um, what else has been happening? Um, Saison in the background, you can see over here. Um, uh, it's fully fermented out. It's been a week. Um, don't know. Help me. Comment. Tell me what I do. Do I leave it for in secondary or do I transfer it? Or t it's tasting really good. It's like I just want to bottle it or keg it now and just go with it. So what do I do? Secondary? Do I go in the secondary? I don't know. I don't know. Sure. Um, and um, what else is happening? Um, yeah. Not much actually, other than the excitement of the craft beer festival we're getting all amped up for and down here in Dunedin. Oh. Planning a trip to Wellington in end of, oh no end of end of oh no eleventh uh, or something of October so um, plan to go to um, that Japanese joint whatever it's called yeah you go you're all saying it now you know what it is things of H and Z and something like that and a uh, little beer quarter and um, yeah so I'm free for a day I'm up there doing some more calls going to do some beer research or something like that um, yeah so um, you know, except other cool places I should go. I don't know, Malt House, yeah. I used to live in Wellington. I think the best things have changed since I was there back then. So, um, but yeah, that's all that's been happening. Hey, so um, happy Homebrew Wednesday. And if you feel like um, sharing our little <laughs> crazy video with your brew mates, go for it. I'll leave a link below. Um, and all the best from Dunedin. See you next week.